It's Wheel Talk, Wheel Life, with the legendary Corey Bain. What? Who can do that? Like, come on, man. That's one wheel gold. What? Bro, even leaving Posse. Love this Miami, Florida. Epic. Love it. Leave it. List it. This is epic. Much. So here I am, Corey again. So he, he was talking about Matt Hoover just being a great guy. So anyways, we wanted, we wanted to talk to a guy that, that said he's well over 3,000 one-wheel miles. And for a noob, you know, I think a noob's anybody at least under 1,000. That's fair to say. What's your favorite fender, man? Tell me, is so, it carbon uh, fiber? It's not the one-wheel one, obviously. The one-wheel one, uh, I think, you know, everybody hates on the one-wheel fender, and I'll be honest. Um, I think that to a degree, there's some variability in the reliability of those fenders. Um, I think that there are some batches that are a lot more prone to breaking. Okay. Um, I've had one break on me. Yeah, I broke mine. Uh, I've, and I've had one that it wouldn't break no matter what I did. So I think there's a lot of variability there. Sure. Uh, these days, I won't run anything but carbon fiber. Okay. Uh, uh, but so I won't run anything but carbon fiber. It's, it's only craft and ride. Yeah. Uh, I like the fit and form of their fender much better. Uh, so craft and ride makes the best fender that that forms, fits. Absolutely. It's Legit. Strong. You can't break it. Well, I shouldn't say you can't. I certainly haven't, and I try. Dude, if, uh, if anybody's ever ridden with Corey, please comment and just say. This guy rides hard, and he wears wrist guards and a helmet. Not not fair to me. I don't wear any padding. I'm that guy that it takes away from my experience. But stupidity, ignorance, call it what you want. It is what it is. I got the, the one-wheel armor split fender with the Ego on there with the Ranger. So, Matt Hoover, like, we appreciate your ingenuity. I wouldn't be keeping up with Corey's XR, and I definitely don't keep up. This guy's a beast. But, you know, with the, the carbon fiber fender, he's got that Bluetooth speaker. And we were just blaring it. We were bumping it. Well, it's great to keep pedestrians uh, aware of your presence, right? Yeah. So. <laughs> this guy's like a rolling boombox <laughs> coming through. Exactly. More aesthetically pleasing than a horn, right? Definitely more speed. I'm always like, I'm on your left, you're right. And by the time they look yeah, over, uh, I yeah. go the other way. Yeah, they hear you don't even know what language they're going to speak. So that's not a reliable... <laughs> yeah so uh so, no, I, I definitely always run the carbon fiber fender and um you'll notice i've got a uh a send type system on there it's actually lucas's send type system. Uh, he uh who's lucas uh, lucas pawlowski pawlowski polish pawlowski. yeah polish i like those guys he's uh one of my closest here in miami and uh he really kind of designed this really cool system that's uh hand tightened really nice and grippy comfortable out of the way it looks good i like them yeah yeah um, of course they're they're you know designed after the sin system so he doesn't really sell them in he just you know for a few friends he's made a couple sets but yeah no i'm uh obviously the fender bro the the riding ability of it yeah when i first got the one wheel fender not bad you know i was like why would anybody ride without one of these um to me you know, i'll say it looks like magic with that wheel suspended in the middle of the rails like right. that really hey guys cool. can we get your quick <laughs> Miami, not a chance. <laughs> that wasn't Minnesota nice. <laughs> now, on the upside, he did not ship you. No, I don't think he knew I was talking. He was I was talking to them. <laughs> like I said, that language. I was just gonna get a random um, but no, opinion. So, you know, in all honesty, uh, there are a couple of accessories from Craft and Ride that I can't do without. Uh, the one tail plus, I love it. Uh, it extends my ride out. I like 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 it. Uh, if I had the money, I'd buy a Jeff White tail. They're they're not really a lot more expensive, I guess, but um, you know you gotta do about. Welcome to Miami. So, uh, I'm just pissed off. Will Smith isn't sitting with us. So yeah, if I had the uh, money, I'd buy nothing but Jeff White one tails. They're really really nice. Jeff White one tails. I don't even know what that means. So they're they're the. Uh, he makes custom, I should say white nails, I guess. Ah! 
White Tails, tell me what are those little silver things on the bottom? Those my uh, new Guardian brand armor plates. Yeah, we just settled on the name this morning, by the way. Uh, Guardian, Guardian brand, brand armor plates. What kind of tire? That's the Hoosier 6.0 slick? Yeah, 6.0 slick. So if you want to take a look real quick at those plates on the back. The plates that's, on the back. Look, look at the, that's the front up there, the back over here. Um, but if you look at those, you'll notice the uh, wear and tear on that one side there, especially. And that's, uh, that's about 250 uh, fairly hard tail drag slides. So, wait, uh, wait, wait. So 250 hard tail drag slides. So what we saw you doing, where you go with a little burnout or just... Yeah, just lots and lots and lots of that all the time. I've been testing these, seeing how tough they are. Dude, talk uh, about he got game. I just... <laughs> thanks, brother. Um, I, I'm pretty pleased. They seem to be wearing even better than I anticipated for the aluminum. I uh, can't wait to get my hands on the stainless steel, hopefully this afternoon, and uh, do some testing on those as well. Also, I uh, hope to take delivery of a big shipment of these today or tomorrow, and Thank should you. be getting those out there for sale. So. Yeah. That's sick. Um, we have food. Food is beautiful. Food! food! So make sure when you talk about one wheels, you go to a cool ceviche restaurant. So no, I've uh, I've been riding the one tail plus for 50 something miles now. Just like I was telling you earlier, I've put on maybe 50, 60. By the time I leave Miami, it'll be like 70 plus miles. And uh, Minnesota, five and a half inches on Monday. <laughs> you you don't ride 50 miles. And then so we're rocking. Uh, he let me borrow his 5.0 on the Ranger mod, like. I don't know when my battery's ever gonna die. But that's the one wheel armor plus fender. I, I love the look of the meaty tire. Right under, that's the Burris 6.0. Tire's riding unbelievable. So before I left, I think I told you, but I did the wheel bearing. Um, the tire went from the Vegas Slick, which I literally haven't put any miles on this wheel because who wants to ride a Vegas Slick? Not me. But anyways, we're gonna eat. You guys, uh, 10X. Back. Yeah, I really am pretty amazing. So I've just literally watched you do 10 of those? 15 yeah, of those? At least, right? And I don't I mean, think it's we're something- now, We're now up to hundreds of them. And I mean, it's just barely starting to even touch that screw. Um, yeah, barely. That's hundreds of them. Like, I don't know, maybe a quarter mile of slide. <laughs> quarter mile. And then the last slide uh, everybody will have just seen was, I think we we're going about 10, 12 right. miles an hour. So, like, uh, I gotta applaud and compliment your fearlessness. Thank you, bro. It's just pain. It goes away. Glory lasts forever, bro. Glory lasts forever, bro. There's our joggers. All right, so to uh, to go back to.